This is Cruise News Today with Doug Parker. Good morning. Here's your cruise news for Monday, August 21st. Three Southern California cruise lines had to amend their itineraries over the weekend for passenger safety and comfort. Over what was Hurricane Hillary, now Tropical Storm, Princess Cruises Emerald Princess and Royal Caribbean's Navigator of the Seas both adjusted their routes, with Princess coming back to L.A. yesterday and Royal Caribbean flipping Ensenada in a day at sea. Meanwhile, Carnival Panorama that left Long Beach on Saturday is expected to arrive in Cabo tomorrow. It is dropping Mazatlan on this week's itinerary. According to weather reports on Sunday, the weather buoys were showing seas from six to nine feet off the coast of California. And a 40-year-old crewman has tragically died from the Viking Mars while it was docked in Invergordon, Scotland on Friday. Now, despite the immediate response of two ambulances and a trauma team, the man succumbed to his injuries after being airlifted to Aberdeen Royal Infirmary. Viking Cruises expressed their condolences to the crew member's family and is collaborating with local authorities to investigate the circumstances. Now, since the ship was docked, it's unclear if he was doing a job like washing the windows and fell or if something else happened. The company's health and safety executive is also examining the event. And finally, by the end of the year, Carnival Cruise Line will have updated its main dining room menus across all of its North America-based ships. This according to Carnival's brand ambassador, John Heald, on Facebook last week. Now, these new menus started in June with Carnival Dream and has slowly started rolling out to other ships across the fleet and will do so by the end of the year. Now, the two Australian-based ships, Carnival Luminosa and Carnival Splendor, they'll adopt the new menus at the start of next year. Under the guidance of Chief Culinary Officer Emerald Gossi. The revamped menus will feature around 60 new entree presentations, including some New Orleans-style dishes from Emerald and some selections from specialty restaurants throughout the ships in the fleet. And cruise line stocks were down on Friday. Carnival Corporation down 1.3%, 15.59. Royal Caribbean down less than a percent, 99.20. Norwegian down the same, 16.68. Breaking news and industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. For daily updates, subscribe to the Cruise Radio YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.